Okay, hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to back up your packages with package backup. Now, I know a lot of people, there's been the release of the form, firmware 3.1.3, and I know that if you want to back up your packages, maybe like save them for later. I'm not totally sure what this feature, what this can totally do, but I know it can help you in some sort of way. Now, um, so the, the point of, I'm making this video because the firmware has just been released and people might want to you know update the firmware and then jailbreak again without having to totally restart on all their all their you know uh, city of things like that and what I think this can do is allow you to save these if you uh, read jailbreak but I'm not totally sure and it's a cool app nonetheless so first thing you're going to want to do like always Go into Cydia, go into search, and then go into, into search PKG backup. Probably noticed this by now, but my takes a while for me to do. So you can see there's the cracked version from B your iPhone, there's the big boss one. You can see it here, but this one, if you want to get it, you know, it's free. You're gonna want to get the B your iPhone one. Now, I'm I'm not recommending this, but you know, if that's what you want to do, then this is the one for you. Or there's the one down here from Sinful iPhone Repo. But since all my other ones are from B your iPhone, I'll just stick with B your iPhone. So you're gonna want to click on this. You're going to want to click install up here. It says modify for me since I've downloaded it. And then once you download that, you will get a icon that looks like this. I'll say package backup. Might take a little bit for the first time to it load itself but should be pretty simple there we go see it's loading the data from must have like a you know a big server out there and see you can see active packages to back up and previous packages to restore click on the restore packages you can see city of download stats it's in that blue font color there and that means I backed it up when I had that downloaded and then I I recently deleted it because I didn't have much use for it and so it's still showing up here and you say GBA BIOS I couldn't get that working so really no point for me having that and so you can go back into package backup, and I'm just get, I can, can just re back up. So you're gonna click the backup button. It'll give you a nice little loading thing down here, which I think kind of looks cool. But it's pretty straightforward. I mean, you click that. That will back it up, and then it's gonna tell you to sync with iTunes. And you can see that your packages that Restore has changed, where it's kind of realized, oh, he doesn't really want, he doesn't want that one, all those packages that he used before, and so that's, so it just doesn't need that anymore. So this is good if you have like a problem or anything like that and you have to delete it. You can always come back here to restore it. I believe if you download this again, it, it should keep the same. I mean, if you happen to do this and you try that out, please just comment on it and tell me so I can like alter the description. So that's basically how you back up your packages with package backup. It's pretty simple. I don't know if you need a tutorial on this. Just just the name is basically the thing you need to know. I'll have the Be Your iPhone source in the description. And that's about it. Have a good day.